Look, if anyone can do it, Dumpling King can. That man plays heavies like nobody else does. And speaking of which, we got a sword that plays like nobody else does. Helper versus John Numbers. All right, Helper starting things off with a little bit of a three-piece combo, getting Numbers off stage where I feel like this match is going to take place quite a bit. We're going to be seeing a lot of ledge play from these two. Why is John Numbers' name formatted like that? I don't know. I was saying it earlier. I swear, it just looks like a bootleg, like John Num Twitter imposter John, John Numbers. Numbers. Going so far out. Oh, doesn't quite get the outside hitbox of the up B. So John is living that. Thank you for changing the formatting on it. It was yeah, killing me. No, of course. But, <laughs> like. Huh. This has Helper uh, written all over it. <laughs> so. You're starting to see why Helper did take it over John last week. They are going in deep against John and doing a really good job of weaving through these spike situations that John loves. As we the trainer has three spikes. Oh, oh no! no! Oh, you know what? You know what? That, that's just the SD. They, they, they even know it. They just started. They're like, Helper, you know, everyone gets H one. HO3K, help me. Please. <laughs> Please stay on the stage. I know it's a tall order. <laughs> this this <laughs> is why they're not on PR anymore. Were, they can't that, suicide like that and be on PR. He did that while you were saying, yeah, he's doing such a good job of going out. And it's, well, Production curse. I didn't say shit. What are you oh, that was about? me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a purely casted curse. Please stay on the stage. Ooh, yeah, John mixing up the match timing. and Helper is already not having a good time in the player cam. Oh. I mean, even John is kind of like just locked in, like just squinted eyes being like, hmm. John typically do does not show much emotion in the player cam. Meanwhile, Helper is an, ex an incredibly expressive player. Yes, and I do love right it. As seen right here. Helper did a really good job of not jumping over John. It is one of the most dangerous places you can be against him. You got the up smash, you got the header, you got the up air. So dangerous and an untackable. It lasted like two seconds. John, John is now in a very healthy stock lead here in game one. The winner of this does move on to fight Dill in winner's finals. Let's see if Helper is able to come back after that kind of unfortunate first stock. You know, really good idea there with the counter, but I wonder what the... Like, if it's under the legs, I guess it didn't, like, actually do much. Because it does have to be, like, right in front of you. Yeah. All right, Helper does bring us to even stocks. But the deep breathing coming through, catching Helper's double jump, and excuse me? soft down air. Look, John's happy about that one. <laughs> He's like, yeah, yeah I killed soft good. down air. Helper taking a moment for themselves. Maybe they can join Fawn outside and uh, take a breather. <laughs> That was yeah, goofy, was... but that was such a good trap because, yeah. <laughs> Same. If we can get that as an emote on the channel. Oh, no. H03K shrug. Yes. <laughs> yeah, we, we need the, the shrugs. Please. But now we're running it back. Small battlefield, no changes here. All right, Helper just running things right back into small battlefield, thinking, you know, if he doesn't SD that first stock, he can keep that momentum that, we, that we've that we seen him get before. He's fine. Yeah. He's Emotionally, not, maybe not. like, very fine, but, like, he's alive. I want <laughs> oh God. I Part of me wishes Helper was not wearing his mask so I could see what he was saying, because he was clearly speaking while he I, was getting caught there. I don't recognize him without his mask anymore. I, yeah. I've seen him without the mask, and I'm like, who are you? <laughs> it's like seeing Jump your scare. dad without a beard. All right, that F-Tilt sweep is now going to be putting Helper in stage advantage as he tries to go out and challenge with the forward airs. Has to take a wide-angle recovery to get back onto stage. You might as well just have the entire match off stage at this point. And untackable again! And once again. Oh, Helper is not pleased. No, but they were doing all the right things at exactly the right time, but it doesn't really mean anything, and he doesn't know why. All right. I, a hula hoop reversal, not something we see very often, but John not wanting to respect that pressure of the, the staggered forward airs. But what do we see here? 
Maybe trying to get a good command. Oh no! Fantastic Tomahawk. You could see John was angling his shield, looking to shield an aerial. Guess who also which, has really good up airs? Sora. But which, a better forward tilt is coming out from John. Yeah. Which, by the way, guys, if you know, if you don't, you should angle your shield towards landing aerials because if if the aerial hits further up, then they're gonna have less frame advantage on landing. But Helper right now finding himself in the advantage, getting that first stock finally from John. What do we see here? Helper just trying oh, to shark John's uh, coming in. No, but instead gets hit themselves with the up smash. The Helper just a little too scared with that shield and John taking advantage. Yeah, John threatening with the sun salutation was so scary. You can see him flash it for just a second to get a rise out of Helper. Well, to be honest, John just standing there is also Very menacing. John threatens when they get on the station. <laughs> what are they doing here? All right, this it's gonna, gonna be, be seeing the other side of the stage, but that is gonna give John more opportunity to charge that full sun salutation. The sun sal is fully charged. Not anymore though. But Keep. Helper getting caught by the header. Yep, and just keeping this space up. Finally though, Helper getting a starter there with the up airs has to chase John out so far. Sora does have the mobility, but not quite the speed to really challenge Weefit as she is able to get her resources back up once again with the deep breathing. I'm surprised that the up special actually didn't kill, but that still <gasps> deep nothing? breathing coming through, reducing the damage just enough. And why did we fit side swap there out of the trade? Oh, we'll have to see that in the VOD later on. It was very Num confusing for me too. Numbers has just been robbed of this second stock so many times. And you saw there, John just kind of started like low profiling to avoid any sort of like aerial. Oh my god, no going way. so deep, looking for these forward airs, trying to hit him with any sort of hitbox. But John can just not be pinned down. When you're trying to be too aggressive against John, you tend to forget that the Sun Salutation is fully charged. Mm -hmm. And you'll get a fistful of it, but hey, 36%. I mean, this has just kind of been, like, the classic numbers game plan of just, like, you know, making you think you can go out and challenge John numbers, and then you get reversal for it. But you know what? If you're this far in bracket, winner semis at a Xeno Weekly, you can take down John. You can still take he down can John. It is still within the realm of possibilities that Helper takes down John right now. But we're going to have to see a game three first, and to see that, Helper has got to pull out a miracle for this last stock. Yeah, that's on Sally's No, still living. Just barely living. Sora's got bricks in those big old clown shoes. And this is how he's cheating. Just filled it with <laughs> cement. Oh, no. He's got the cement shoes. We're going to see the if he's stuck at the killing. bottom of the lake. Oh, deep breathing. Kill throws are online. Helper has to, has to be scared of Hold everything me for us, right armor. now. I'm falling off my chair. <laughs> it's so scary. Oh, good. Here it comes. No, uh -oh. this could be okay. it. This Helper, could be big. Yeah, Helper getting an in. He's got a lot of rage right now, but not able to cover the, uh, the neutral getup. Another mid-charge Sun Sal. Oh, here comes another one. No, Finally, though. even I got mixed. Helper, Helper nodding knew, knew that his time had come. And John is going to be the one who moves on into winner's finals. I do not ask for who the fitness advice is for. It is for the... Yeah, it was just untackable situation after untackable situation. Really good job of John just actually holding shield and trying mm -hmm. to bait out the Thundaga. But as you see here, very, very goofy where sometimes Helper had these right situations and just couldn't clutch out a kill and that Sun Salutation just going through everything. Yeah, it was just kind of an issue of Helper trying to take space when it wasn't quite his turn as far as resources were concerned. Now, if we do see here in the very last stock, 210%. Right? Good so, what was Lord. happening there was John had thrown out Sun Salutation like three times already. And Helper was expecting that to happen again. And as he goes in, tries to Tomahawk. No, John goes in and does the up air. Yeah, but it was a really good conditioning. Yeah. Speaking of conditioning, I am conditioned to always root for Ice Climbers. I know that we're not on our next set just yet, but I did want to shout out Justin, JPEG, and Seal down there. Ooh, okay, we've got 
hot ICs gameplay coming 